welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to feature my current hair care routine. Now, I know my everyday curls is one of my most highly requested videos, and I promise that is heading your way shortly. But first, I thought it would be very important to touch on the products that not only ensure my hairstyle remains the way that I style it, but also ensures that my hair is healthy and voluminous and shiny and all of those other descriptions we're looking for when we style our hair. If you are enjoying my uploads, please make sure you click that bell button down below. That is the only way that YouTube is ensuring that you'll see my new videos. So for your info, I do upload every Monday and I do upload every Thursday. So please check your subscription box and know that there will be a new video for me every Monday and every Thursday. And if you're not seeing it, it's because you haven't clicked that bell. So definitely go do that right now. Pause this video and hit that bell. But because my hair seems to be such a requested topic on my channel, like I mentioned, I wanted to talk about the products that I think have completely transformed my hair and allow my hair to be as healthy as it appears because I do really, really enjoy taking care of my hair. I think hair care is something that is really, really vital to styling. Um, I think that if you don't have a good hair care routine, your style might not hold as well as you want it to. So let me talk about what I do in the shower. I do wash my hair about three times a week. Um, it all kind of just depends on what my schedule is like. Um, maybe Maybe I need to wash it for a certain event. Maybe I've been working out and it got really sweaty. It just all depends. I find that these products ensure that my hair doesn't get oily quick and that it doesn't smell. So that is important when you work out as much as I do because those are the two factors that would happen from sweating so much. But enough about a sweaty head. Um, my current shampoo is by Monate and this is the Renew Shampoo. So it is infused with the Rejuvenique oil, which I will show a little bit later in this video, but it aims to moisturize, shine, and strengthen. And this shampoo is targeted for hair that needs hydration. So the reason why I like Monate is because it's an all natural line it's vegan it's gluten free it's non-toxic and it is cruelty free as well so that's really awesome there's no parabens there's no sulfates so you're really ensuring that your hair follicles are really getting penetrated Monet's actually the first hair care line to penetrate the hair cortex so it really helps stimulate growth um, which is another reason why I like using it so I'm currently using the shampoo and then I'm pairing it with the revitalized conditioner again this is in Fused with the rejuvenique oil and this description says it helps increase hair density again with the hair growth strength and manageability so I do have some exciting news and that is I am now a market partner for Monate so please if you have any questions or hair concerns head on over to my Instagram I can ask you a little hair quiz kind of see what your hair goals are and recommend some products that I think will completely transform your hair so I'm always open to answering questions about Monique products, so definitely do not be shy when it comes to asking those questions. I also want to kind of open up a business offer as well. If you would like to join my team and kind of be involved in social media and work for yourself, again, head on over to my Instagram and I can kind of explain how this partnership works. But this is currently my shampoo and conditioner routine, these two products. Now, I do like using olive oil topically as a hair mask, but I do have three hair masks that I enjoy using after I um, shampoo and condition my hair as well. Two of them are from Diva Curl. Now, I really like Diva Curl because I do have naturally wavy hair, and I find that Diva Curl does not weigh down my waves. So the first one I'm going to mention is this Diva Curl Melt Into Moisture. It's a matcha butter conditioning mask. Diva Curl is also sulfate, paraben, and silicone free. Oh, this one smells amazing and it looks good enough to eat. I wish I could eat it. That's kind of strange, but your girl likes sweets. So if it was a matcha mousse, I would for sure eat it. Um, and this next one is Heaven and Hair. It's an intense moisture treatment. Again, no harmful chemicals. So Diva Curl is a great line. I have another product by them I'm going to show you as well. But those are definitely two of my favorite masks when I really want to embrace my curls. I am also loving my Monate Replenish Mask. Again, it has the Rejuvenique oil in it, which is awesome. This just really helps with your hair strength and vitality. So if you're finding that you're getting hair breakage, I find that this really, really helps kind of mend any split ends that you have and really just restores that moisture that maybe you've been taking out by using any heat products on your hair. So I really, really enjoyed that. I'll leave those masks on for about 20 to 30 minutes. I'll insulate it with a hair mask and then of course I'll rinse it out. So after I'm done rinsing out my mask, I will brush my hair with a wide tooth comb. 
and I do like applying a leave-in conditioner. So I have three that I want to talk to you about. Um, the first one is going to be Pureology. This is a Color Fanatic Multitasking Hair Beautifier. I love this stuff. I think it leaves my hair very, very smooth and silky. Um, and it says that it primes, protects, and perfects. So those are the three key points of this product. I also really like the Aveda Damage Remedy Daily Hair Repair. This instantly repairs and protects for heat styling. So I think this one is really awesome as well and a little goes a long way with all of these products. So that's really important because I don't want to have to constantly be buying new hair care. I like using a product that's concentrated enough that I can have it last for a long time. Um, another leave-in conditioner, this is a Living Proof Perfect Hair Day Nightcap Overnight Perfector. Again, just leaves your hair very silky, very smooth, and um, I highly recommend any of those three. After I've applied my leave-in conditioner, I do like to use hair oils. I am very, very keen on having a hair care routine. I think, like I mentioned in the intro, that in order to have beautiful hair that styles well, you need to have products that work well with your hair texture. So I'm actually almost finished with this Way hair oil. As you can see, I don't have much of it left. Um, but this is by Jen Atkins. It helps prime your hair if you're going to use any heat tools on it. Um, and it also um, repairs split ends as well. I've been talking about this so much, so it's about time that I feature this. This is the Rejuvenique by Monate. Um, the reason why I like this oil is because not only can it be applied to your hair, but it's also really good for your skin as well. So I have a little... Um, psoriasis patch on my elbow that I've been applying it to. Um, if you have psoriasis on your scalp, this is really important. Um, and it just really, really has so many uses. There's over 100 uses for this oil. Not only does a little bit go a long way, but you can find so many various ways to incorporate this into your beauty routine. So I highly, highly recommend. You will be seeing this in an upcoming video of how I curl my hair, I promise, but I just thought I would feature it to give you an idea. Um, this is the One Inch Barrel by Baby Bliss. Yes, this is a Baby Bliss Pro, and it's just a ceramic curling iron. So I like it. It heats up. I actually burnt my head today. I don't know if I did a good job of covering it with makeup, but I am the queen of burning myself with the curling iron. I told my mom that I burnt my head again today, and she's like, why don't you pay attention? I'm like, mom, I do pay attention. I don't know. I don't know what it has against me. The hair curling iron, hot tools just don't work well with me. Um, but to set my curls, I am currently using the Redken Triple Take 32. This is an extreme high hold hairspray. I have it in my hair today and I do not think that it has a high hold in the sense that my hair is still very flexible. I don't like crunchy hair. I don't like crunchy curls and this still has a lot of body and a lot of movement. If you want to see what the spritzer looks like, it's nicely distributed, very finely misted. As soon as I'm done styling my curls, and I feel like sometimes my hair needs a little bit more volume because let's be honest, this is day one hair. I just washed it, and there's nothing better than day two hair. Day two hair is the best, um, but in order to get that day two hair, you kind of need some grit in your hair. Uh, this Not Your Mother's Girl Powder Volumizing Hair Powder is the best. I love this stuff. If you want volume, if you want texture, and if you want your head to not move, this is your girl. Um, when I mean not move, like you're not gonna be able to like nicely run your fingers through your hair. Like that's not really a thing, but you will have some high pile volume. So it's just kind of all what you're looking for. 10 out of 10 would recommend this though. However, I do find that it kind of makes my hair a little bit greasier, like sooner than it needs to be. But I like volume. Gotta give and take a little bit. The last two products I don't use very often, but I like them enough to mention. Now, again, I've said that I was gonna feature a product by Diva Curl. This is the Diva Curl Super Cream Coconut Curl Styler. Again, silicone free, paraben free, and sulfate free. Um, and this is good for style and shape. So I like to use this on days where I'm not using any heat and I just kind of want my natural curls to hold their own shape. So I'll just apply a little bit of this in my hands, kind of scrunch it and you know, kind of texturize my curls a little bit. And then I have a Diva Curl towel that kind of just soaks up any extra moisture. And this just really allows your hair to do its thing, to be itself and to let wild. So I really, really like this product and it's very smoothing on your hair as well. And just so you know, Diva Curls packaging does have a very large description on it. It says, is it for me? What does it do? And how do I use it? So I think that's really important if you're not kind of sure what direction to take a hair care product. 
Diva Curl spells it out for you. Last but not least, this is the KQC Thermal Shine Brilliant Thermique. Uh, it claims to help smooth shine and it's used for heat protection. So you can use it with a flat iron or a hair dryer. Now I don't straighten my hair very often, but anytime I do, I use this stuff. The mister on this is also very fine and kind of just evenly distributes that shine. Let me actually get some of it right now. Um, you could use this with curls, but I do just find it works really nice with straight hair. Um, so for my straight hair girls, I figured I would recommend this product. I hope you guys found this video helpful and definitely found some new products that you may want to try. Everything will be listed in the down bar as well as some links that you could purchase it through if you decided to do that. Um, and please, like I said, feel free to follow me on Instagram, message me on Instagram. Instagram is my go-to for communication with you guys. Like, of course, I respond to comments on here, but if you have kind of like a longer message, whether it be you want life advice or product suggestions or whatever the case may be, Instagram is my main source to talk to you. So please use it and kind of stay up to date with what I'm doing anyways. I always post like little um, product suggestions or kind of insights into what video I'm filming. So if you wanna stay up to date with me, make sure you're following it. Let's all work towards healthy hair, hashtag healthy hair revolution. And until my next video, I will see you guys then. Bye. Mwah.